What up my chillers? Now, as promised, I'm back to dive into this M disc. And let's see exactly what M said about Melly Mel. Let's, let's dive into this. Let's dig right into this. Guess I've really no right to complain much. Yeah. Hip hop has been good to me, huh? Well, but when they say that I'm only top five, because I'm white, why would I be stunned? Uh, My skin color's still working against me. What? Who said he only top five because he white? Obviously, he's a capable rapper. If you was talking about sales, he sold more than everybody. If you're talking about rhyme style, okay, he got a rhyme style. But he's white. He's white. So now if Eminem was just another nigga like all the rest of us, would he be top five on that list when a nigga that Karam just as good as him is 35? that had records and all that. He's white. And, 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 and the point is this, if I was white, they, I'd be greater than Elvis. Like, Melly Mel is greater than Elvis. Melly Mel is the greatest white man that has ever lived. But I'm not white. Okay. Cause second, I should be the nun. I should be second to none. Cause the play on second to none. Yeah, I get it. They put me at five. Nope. It's why they can't put me at one. They're coming with more venom, so the haters I'm aiming it toward them. And all the envious rappers I torch if I'm on a joint with them. And that is the only retort, is I'm not played in the clubs. Motherfucker put a cork in it. Only reason they still play your shit in the clubs is cause you still perform in them. Hmm. They don't play your shit in the clubs. I believe that's what Game had to say. They don't play them shit in the club. Um, uh, when have you ever heard Eminem song in the club? At uh, the places that I've been to. When have you ever heard them in the locker room? In the club. I am a guest in this house, but I turn this bitch to a mansion. That's an expansion. Made it gargantuan. I am a guest in this house. I, I believe it was, uh, was it Lord Jamar? This said he's a guest in hip hop. Hmm. And them say, but I turn this bitch into a mansion. In the house of hip hop. Well, no, I, 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 how he became a part of the conversation is you said Eminem too. I'm like, yeah, Eminem too. Like all of them. Eminem, Beastie Boys, Rick Rubin, all of them. Oh. This house, but I turn this bitch to a mansion. That's an expansion. Made it gargantuan. England, Germany, France, and Japan's in this bitch, even Dubai. Because my music, they do buy. You died trying to sign just two side guys. Just could not unscrew my head up the blue eyed devil. I never quit, do I? Not because you know you get washed like a bar. So you pussy, you wouldn't give a cigar to smoke. I know it eats at your heart like an artichoke. Because you know that's how likely you are to choke. Your heart is broke as I rip you apart. I go bananas, proceed to spit every bar. Bro. I was spitting before my mother's water broke. It's not even close, you bitch. I'm my father go. Gen Z is acting like rap experts. Sip up your gaps and close your mouths. Who the fuck is Gen Z? I'ma look them up. Yeah. Bitch, you ain't been on this planet long enough to tell me how rap's supposed to sound. Nah. Y'all need to stick to what you do best. Right. Shooting schools up, yeah. Go load up rounds in your parents' gats and go to class and let off at the strap and go to town. Right. Shout to the Furious Five and Grandmaster Flash, but boy, up, boy, there's someone who really is furious. Stay out his path, his wrath, avoid her. Right. And I'll be the last to toy with a juice head. Of <laughs> Did you hear it? Y'all know what that is? In case you don't know what that is, uh, in early hip hop, uh, rappers would be like, Urgh. they just, Urgh. they would do make that sound, and that sound always got on my nerves, man. It really did, and 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 he like even Run DMC did it a little bit, and I was like, hey, Run DMC, that's a whack rappers, because once Run DMC came out, they were the top of the line. You know what I mean? They, you know what I mean? They weren't like uh, on whack whack rapper level. They were at the top of the motherfucking chain. But uh, yeah, that always bothered me. And, and I'm glad him put that in there because, you know, it just makes a statement about his style. Come on, man. That his brain is like half destroyed, like a meteor hit it. Well, then with Melly Mel, we lost his asteroid scams. God was like, I got him, but I'm gonna start him at the bottom of the barrel. Brought him in the world where the mother was in volume, and his father was a cow. Taught him as a child when the fucking body was around. How to get himself up and out of poverty, and now not even a growl in his stomach. Gotta be a hound to so put your body in the ground. Probably gonna sound like a cliche, but when haters try to get you down, say, Fuck him, cause I'm the witness in the business, and everybody gonna be envious. I'm the guest, I got a service for the sins, who bodies just stop trying to be in the other Cause I'm the witness in the business, and everybody gonna be envious. I'm the guest. I'm just playing Gen Z. You know I love you. Say we lost in the roids. <laughs> Melly Mel is big though, you know what I mean? Um, is he on roids? I don't know. He's been a big boy for a long time. I don't know. I mean, and you could say, you know, you, you could question, you could say, hey, 
he been working out for a long time, you know, and I truly believe working out for a long time, you can just get swole and swoller and swoller without steroids. Whether he used steroids or not, yeah, we're going to have to ask him because M's the expert on that one. But uh, anyway, uh, that's what them had to say. Now I'm going to go check out Melly Mel's this. So yeah, yeah, come on y'all, go ahead and uh, go ahead and push that subscribe button so that way you be here, you get that notification when we come back and uh, we kick back, relax, yeah, and we get back to doing what we do, and that's that. But anyway, I hope y'all like the vibe. Go ahead, and like and subscribe. Come on back. We gonna chop it up. We gonna kick it. But yeah, take care of yourselves. I'ma holler at you next time. Next time, <clears throat> stacking your reactions, cause we out, baby. We out.